As a light technology developed specifically for plants, we took into account that there are two kinds of plants and two stages of plant growth. The vegetative stage, where plants like brilliant blue-white light, and the flowering stage, where plants like more reddish light. So unlike any other induction light developers, we made two kinds of bulbs, vegetative and flowering, a true innovation in agricultural lighting. If anyone tells you they have a bulb that can do both at the same time, that tells you they simply don't understand plant science. For the first time now, there is a a light source that has a full spectrum of the sun in it, but also has higher nanometer ranges of color for both vegetative and flowering stages. The end result is a light source that can actually enhance photosynthetic properties of chlorophyll greater than even sunlight. What the grower saw when using iGrow in the veg stage was the following. More robust plants that produced significantly greater root mass, had closer internode spacing, and that were typically ready to move to the flower room 2 to 10 days faster. All these growers had been using T5s or metal halides, and iGrow outperformed both and used significantly less power to do so. So let's analyze what we now have. The benefit of greater root mass is twofold. It accelerates flowering and also produces healthier flowers. Closer internode spacing equates to more flower sites, which equates to higher yields. And accelerating the time spent in the vegetative stage means an increase in the number of plant rotations through the year. As you've probably already figured out, each of these things significantly increases revenue for the grower.